you. And we are tracking the tropics tonight, where not one but two areas of interest could become our first named storms. Let's get right to Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer with the latest. Craig. Carly, we're tracking two systems. They really haven't changed much through the day and even through the night tonight. In fact, as you can see, there's a big swirl from earlier in the day that was east of Bermuda. And then this other swirl that is in the Gulf of Mexico lifting to the northwest. This is a, a low pressure area. It's small. And if we were probably later in the year, this would quickly become a tropical depression and then maybe even a tropical storm. But the waters are still a little bit cool. There's some drier interacting with the system. And so it also doesn't have a lot of time to get to the coast now, which is a good thing. All these are Things so you can see, in fact, the satellite loop this evening in the western Gulf pretty quiet, no reds or anything like that. There's where the center is. Once again, it's moving pretty quickly to the northwest. We'll be on shore later tonight, and that's when that development process stops. But still, heavy rain and gusty winds for Texas and parts of Louisiana. The other system we're watching, it's out in the Atlantic. Hasn't changed much this evening. Could become a subtropical storm. If that happens, we'd have advisors on it and we would get, take care of the first name there, Anna. Hard to say if that's going to happen, but obviously we'll be watching. I'll be back in just a little bit with the weekend forecast. It's looking fantastic.